Well, I remember almost 50 years ago, the company starting in my parents' basement and complete lack of technology and lack of any kind of flair. It was a brave move for I and S, uh, Gene Isaacson and Ken Serpernant. And, and really the silent partner in all that was my mom. But 1973 is a huge watershed moment, just starting, then gutting it through for the next 20 years. And I'm not sure exactly how they did it. I think their vision was just to be able to make payroll. <laughs> and it wasn't uh, probably a heck of a lot more than that. You know, do good work, make payroll. My dad always said that if he won the lottery, he wanted to just keep doing the same stuff, but never send out an invoice. Just very modest ideals. And when I joined the firm in 1993, I mean, I think I had bigger ideas. I saw things that were happening in the Mankato area that I wanted us to be a part of and probably positioned the way we were at the time. Maybe we weren't going to be. And so that it drove me to get our business to a, a larger point. 1998 was the first time that we got into an office where we really could expand significantly going from a home office to ultimately getting to U.S. Bank Center here in downtown Mankato. It's a significant change. There was a, a group of people that joined from about 1999 to 2001 that became significant leaders within the organization and got us to places that we never thought we were going to get before. You know, Dan Stieber, Chuck Brandall, Tony Effenberg, Joe Winnegar, Justin Steffel, all of those people in a very small period of time, they're all still here. We expanded into Faribault, Minnesota and hired a person to run that office, Lynn Bruins. And, you know, Lynn's now our CEO. And I don't know if you realize that at the time that you're interviewing somebody at Perkins and Faribault, you know, that this is going to have such a lasting and dramatic effect on our firm. ISG's mission of making a difference, make tomorrow better than today, this is exactly what we try to do and it, it's just exactly natural of who we are. Personally, it's what I always try to do. I want to make an impact. I want to make sure that people know that we were here and we left it better than before.